had upon them. They're not worth nothing to nobody, but to me they are. That's all I have left of my son. And it's like taking a piece of me away again. Uh, your heart breaks for this woman. A mother of a fallen soldier is now pleading for thieves to return her son's military medals. And now some in the community are already reaching out to help, including a Vietnam War veteran. Jeff Van Sant has the story. Who's the assault in helicopters? November 6, 1967. A young Ron Tanner is about to get in a fight for his life. And all of a sudden, all heck broke loose. His unit is decimated by North Vietnamese forces. Every one of them was killed within probably 30 seconds. Taking cover in a bomb crater, Tanner fought for hours. The fighting just continued and continued. Bullets are flying everywhere. Grenades are exploding all around him. Someone taking a, a brick wall and slamming you on the back. Tanner yeah. barely survived, and for that battle, he received the Bronze Star and a Purple Heart. Had 13 holes in me, good size ones. He's cherished these medals since the war in Southeast Asia, but he wants to give them up and give them to this woman, Tina Armijo. Her son, Army Specialist Santos Armijo, died in Iraq in 2006, and recently his medals were stolen from her home in Tolleson. It included the Bronze Star and the Purple Heart. That's all I have left of my son. And it's like taking a piece of me away. Tanner can feel for this mother. He understands the sacrifice. He saw it firsthand, losing so many of his friends. Tina hopes the thieves do have a change of heart and return what truly can't be replaced. I have to say who you are and just bring me my medals. Jeff Van Sant, 3 TV. And by the way, we tried reaching out to Tina tonight to see if she would be willing to take Tanner's medals. So far, we have not heard back.